Don't nobody love like some niggas, man. Ain't nothing like nigg niggas. Niggas love so much, man, that no matter how much you've been invaded, no matter how much has been taken from you, no matter how much you've lost, man, in the last couple hundred years, you still, you love, you love everybody. We might not be loving ourselves like that, but man, we love everybody, man. We love everybody. Hey, look, man, you believe in frequency, right? Do you at least, do you at least believe in frequency, my nine? You believe in most high of everything? Keeping the cold? A nigga loves, but a naga, man, that, that Ahab is supreme, man. And if we already love, no matter, we the proof of love, because we ain't going crazy on our, you know, uh, in, on these invaders, you know? We don't walk around checking people like, hey, man, you, you sure you're from here? Even though we, it's evidence of us in every time period spread across the entire earth plane and every continent antarctica i don't care i don't care where you go canada mexico you're gonna see some nagas with locks somewhere on the walls you, you're gonna you're gonna dig up some bones they're gonna be like man this this another naga over here man they're gonna connect you to the nagas of the andaman islands of solomon islands of the indigenous australia and you're going to realize they just started calling Australia, Australia. Before that, they called Antarctica, Australia. Antarctica, Australia. Terra Australia is just the land below. That's why they call Australia the land below. But they talking about Antarctica, boss. You the indigenous Antarcticans. You know what I'm saying? We talking about lands beyond the poles. Nobody loves like some niggas and nagas. We got that love supreme. Because when you in cold and you believe in frequency, then the cold raises your frequency, it raises the frequency of your house, it raises the frequency of your community, your neighborhood. You ain't never spread no A-hop like this before. A nigga got that love in his heart, and Naga got that A-ha, man. A-ha is the Hebrew word for love, man, but we ain't speaking no English. A-ha carries a frequency, and you believe in frequency, huh? So when you keep the cold, you stop murdering your brother, your sister, just to keep score. And hey, you want to check the scoreboard on what happened to the copper color cons right here in America? You want to check this scoreboard what's happened to the copper color cons? Our family scattered all across the earth plane. I love my nagas in Africa. I love my nagas in Australia. I love my nagas in China and Japan. I love my nagas in Russia because we are the roots. We are the German. We are the swarthy. We are the tawny. You know what it is, man, when you came over here, man. Most out of everything, man, you found some very special people. My, they found some love over here, man. We loved up on the hijack. We welcomed the hijack. We said, hijack, here's some things, man. Here's some jewels, man. We thought they was passing through. Hey, take this with you wherever you're going, hijack. Remember us. They said, oh, oh, we gonna remember, boss, because we gonna rewrite history on your head, bow. You believe in frequency? You think this is normal, man? You think this vibe that you're feeling right now is normal, man? <laughs> this vibe right here is frequency, man. I can't make this up, man. It's most high over everything. Five eyes my we out of here. Because when we code up and you put the Most High Creator first, that's not religious. That code written in Exodus 20 in the Bible is not religious. It is a code of conduct for the copper color Khan on this continent. <laughs> the Amaru Khan. The, they say American. You don't spell C-A-N, Khan. It's Khan. You in the frequency of the Most High over everything. That means you got no hijacks in between you and the career. Something coming in between you and your direct link to your source is a hijack, money, whatever it is. It could be a female. It could be a male. <laughs> it could be whatever entity, whatever power you're praying to. Naga, if it ain't the supreme creator of the earth plane, the heavens, the universe, the I'm talking about the spark, man. Whatever language you speak in. You, you plug back into that spark. That is not religion. 
That is you connecting with your parents, your your mother, your father, Ama, Abba. The Christians call her wisdom. That's your Ama. That's your mama. Read Proverbs 8 very slow. Read Proverbs 8 slow. You back in the frequency of Exodus chapter 20. That's when they got the code when they was getting out of captivity. So in order for them to even get free, they had to start keeping some type of, you know, semblance of the code. At least put the hijacks, put their idols away. If we can at least do that, my naga. Hawa, the frequency, the universe, whatever you want to call the source, is going to start responding by default. Because it's in the coding of the code. It's the divine code, right? So, in the quantum game, and quantum physics, a particle knows when it's being observed. They're freaking out. Why does this particle know that it's being measured? And therefore, it changes its conclusion into one possibility instead of being the entire wave of possibilities. Is it a wave or is it a particle, boss? This is quantum. The code is quantum. The code knows when it's being observed. Hawa knows when Hawa is being hearkened to, listened to. Most, however, everything. My naga, that means you ain't going through no religion or no other person or no son of this or nothing. You just relying on the creator like David in Psalms 18. Hawa heard David came down with smoke out of his nose and fire out of his mouth. What does that sound like to you? It sounds like battle form. It sounds like dragon form. I mean, fire out of his mouth, smoke out of his nose, flying on the wings of the wind. Yeah, I mean, what form would you take in battle mode? Might be a flying, fire-breathing dragon who they call the seraph. Seraph. We're talking Isaiah 6 now, because they the highest form of angel is the seraphim. They're singing holy, holy unto Hawa, the creator, in the throne room of Hawa. In Isaiah chapter 6. This is frequency talk. This ain't religion. How you gonna get your community together? You might say, yo, we gotta we, we gotta settle on a code of conduct. Alright, no killing each other. I'm not saying don't defend your house against strangers, but as far as our community, our tribe, we ain't gonna kill each other. That puts us in a higher frequency than a hijack. Now we can speak Hawa. Now we can speak frequency. And with frequency comes dragons. <laughs> comes your a guardian angel, right? Your guardian dragon, my naga. Your kundalini rising. Your energy rises. We're talking cool, cool. That's how you comb up, rise up a community. It's with the code. Get the hijacks out the way. Connect to your source. Most high over everything. No vanity on the wise name. You don't want no vain breath. That's no breath. You don't want vain security. That's no security. You want a security team? When everything goes up, they out of there, boss. You want that type of team? They don't put no vanity on. <gasps> wow, which is your breath and security, your secure breath, your foundational revelation. No killing, no stealing. Have a rest day where the whole tribe can just <gasps> breathe. Rest. Remember Hawa or else you're going to forget Hawa. And this is what happened. So we rest on the seventh day. Is that religion? Did they teach us that in Christianity, boss? Is that what they doing? No, they go to church on a Sunday. And ain't nowhere in the entire Bible does it say to go to church on a Sunday. So someone got to stop and say, who's teaching me this? And how have they changed my ancient love song? All prayers so well. M-H-O-E. We in the frequency. With frequency comes results. It's all in the coding. And it's all Hawaii. Allah Hawaii.